Hello everyone, my name is Brad or Impeccable Victory and this is uh, the BWB series. We're bringing you episode 16 of the BWB series and this is episode 3 of the third house uh, of Josh's house. Um, um, I don't know, we're just going to get into it I guess. Um, last time we did the roof and the walls and stuff, uh, I've been looking at it and I figured out that I want to put these posts, oh my gosh, put these posts here to kind of give the roof itself some support. Uh, while it is probably enough covered uh, on top of the house uh, with not that much overhanging uh, so that it would be like structurally sound and you know you could make it in real life I think I want to add this feature just just to I don't know kind of add to the structure and just the kind of look I thought about it uh, Josh and Josh in his design didn't have it but uh, I'm gonna change the design a little bit and add it myself so uh, one thing uh, off camera I was looking at is these walls here and how this lines directly up with our little skylight here. So um, what we are going to do, I'm going to bring the walls up right now, but I'm just going to put uh, the walls and then a, a, another piece of glass so you can still see uh, that area. And then um, in this video I think we're going to attack the basement area, get that a little finished. Uh, if you remember from all the other BWBs, there's that, uh, what's it called? The like uh, utility room space down there, so I want to get that uh, done, figured out. I'm gonna come in here, and for this, I was gonna keep the walls all the same, with like that glass. I guess I could still do it in here. Uh, you know, usually glass walls aren't like highly used and stuff, but since it's so up high, you can't see into the other rooms, and it's uh, not a big deal. Um, the door for this room. Yeah, can't go there, so it's going to go right here, and then that's going to be our bathroom. Uh, where's my door? There it is. Uh, we don't need our sandstone. Probably will need it later in this video. Watch. Uh, and then for over here, I'm not quite sure exactly where we're going to put this door. Three and two on this side, so there's got to be some type of. There's that. Um, roughly, we'll leave it up there. Uh, this actually opens up to the back, so we can do that. And I'm gonna put the plank in there. Actually, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it like this. And of course, well, I'm stupid. I'm going to need that sandstone that I just put away. And I'm going to need that stuff. What won't I need? Probably a glass pane. Wait, just wait. I'm going to need it in a second. So there, there's the door in the back. It goes like that. Okay, and then let's fill this part out. For this part, we don't actually need that glass top wall because it just isn't necessary, even though it kind of does just add to the this whole connection of the house, everything being the same. So we're going to keep it like that. And then there's doors here to go downstairs. So that's with all the interior walls raised up. This is how it's going to look. And I was actually standing in here after the last video and looking at this, and I really like the way uh, this angle comes down and this looks. Uh, with these corners connected, you can see over them and stuff, and just everything. I, I really like how open and just the way it kind of looks, and uh, I think it translated well into Minecraft. So down here is the place of concern, or whatever you want to call it. Uh, let me get some glowstone. So uh, if you remember from the last video, I said I was going to put uh, the what's it called, the master bedroom down here, uh, because there just wasn't enough room upstairs and I have to make a basement anyways for the um, for the utility room that's down here so I'm just gonna get into that and uh, do that kind of stuff so I'm gonna put the utility room off this way this direction and off this direction I'm gonna put uh, the master bedroom so uh, the master or the utility room is just the stone you know like like in the other videos it's 
just nothingness and uh, nothing's in it just all plain and boring so I'll just get the stone here and fill this out and it's gonna be the exact same uh, like it was with the other buildings it's a 10 by 10 space nothing's changed this is not working well with all this space okay so hopefully I have enough room here actually because here's the edge of the house I guess so we're gonna have that and then we'll have one two three four five it's technically supposed to be there but uh, it's, a, it's only a hundred square foot area so I can make that a hundred square feet any way I'd like so this is just gonna have to work uh, that's a hundred square feet in I guess real life feet. This Minecraft, it'll be a little different. Uh, so this is going to be the room itself. So this dirt is really annoying. Getting in my way. Whatever. Okay. So it'll be one, two... It's only three across. So that means we need to go substantially uh, longer. And honestly, I'm just going to call it here. It may not be exact, but I'm just going to pretend like that's it. Because, like I said, it's nothing extremely important. And uh, I don't think you guys even really care. Uh, you're just watching me do it. fill in the floor of the storage room and then we'll make the walls for the house part or for the master bedroom itself Ugh. okay perfect now I can come up here boom fill this And then this will be the uh, utility room. It's about big enough. It's like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. It's 9 long by 3 wide. That's, uh, that's good enough. And I dug this deep enough so that I could have a tall ceiling where everything's the same. Uh, I know I ran into that problem in my house where it looked a little weird from the upstairs. And over here I have planned for the master bedroom and I plan to drop it down another one uh, just so it kind of has a feel of, I don't know, another level or just kind of a grandiose feeling as you drop down. And uh, just for building's sake right now, I'm going to put a just a plank flooring. Uh, we'll come back. I usually do the like interiors decorating videos and whatnot and when I do that I'll come back and change all those walls and floors and whatever we have there so for the master we're gonna make it a little bit bigger uh, being a master and I'm actually gonna cut this part off since like it's got to be there because of the stairs and whatnot so this will go like this that's not necessary so we're just gonna have it like that and then these will go in here let me check the size first of all I think if we just go till about here that should be a pretty good it's bigger than any of the other uh, masters we've done. I don't want it on that. Alright, so there's where it goes. And then these, like I said, it's bigger than any other master uh, in this series so far, so that should be interesting. For the walls, I'm gonna hold off. Um, actually, no I'm not, because it kinda 
a little weird. Now, you can't really get a real feel for the for the walls yet. I can't get rid of that. So I'm just going to use this as the wall, like I said, for now. And then I can change it at a later date in a later video. So with this wall framing, it actually looks like these walls might not be that much smaller. Or this room won't be that much smaller. Or not smaller, that much bigger. It is a little bit smaller when I add the, the walls in. So this is going to go like this. And then these come across. So it's a little bit bigger. Uh, a little bit. It's got a little bit of this little entrance area too. Um, but what it has is kind of a longer feel as opposed to a more square or evenly spaced out room. Actually, don't even need those because I'm going to be replacing these like this to make the ceiling. Like I said, I dropped it down in extra space so that the ceiling will be uh, what I want, not the flooring of above. So I can do something like this. And then this is a little bit tight, but uh, it doesn't matter because it's just a stairway. It's not really like a living space. And it is movable. I can walk under it and stuff. So it's a little dark in here. Let me throw this in here. Alright, so this will be like the master down here. I actually, it is a little small now that I think about it and see it with the walls up. So maybe I'll change it, but uh, we'll have to see. But it's good. We got the utility room here done and then the bedroom there. And then, well, it's dark out. Um, you have the, the walls that we put up and then the back door. So a little bit of a more of a filler up so we didn't do too much. Put these posts on here. Let me jump. Um, but yeah. So I'm going to call it a video here. Another, it's a little bit shorter than some of these BWBs have been. And uh, a little bit less uh, done in the video itself. But uh, we got what we, uh, we got some stuff that we needed to get done, done. And uh, we'll address the other stuff in a later video. So as always, thanks for watching and be sure to come back next time.